Hi, in this episode I'll show you how to scale attribute values for use in data-defined overrides with the Symbology. Here I have some sensor data with detected Wi-Fi networks. One field contains the signal strength, which I might want to use to control some aspect of the symbol style. It could be symbol size, rotation or any number of possible overrides. In this case, I will use the size. If I set this field to directly control the size, it will be unusable. So first, I examine what sizes are usable, and in this case, values between 2 and 20 seems suitable. Here I use the styling doc, available in QGIS 2.16 but the previous properties dialog worked just fine. In the data defined overrides for the size, I choose Edit. Under Math, you will find two scaling functions, one linear and one exponential. In my case, the signal strength is logarithmic, so I use the exponential scaling, but both work fine. The function has a few parameters, and to make it easier to build my expression, I usually create a temporary layout in the expression builder. Then it's time to replace the structure with values. The first is the actual field data. The second and third are the minimum and maximum value of the actual value domain. To use the layer's current min and max values, I simply use the minimum and maximum functions on the value field. As the mapped values, I choose the previously tested suitable minimum and maximum symbol sizes. Now I can play with the exponent value to change the scaling. Values lower than 1 will ease the scale out. Larger values will ease the scale in. I'm not very scientific about this, so I just try to find something that looks good. You can use this method on several data-defined overrides, and linear or exponential scaling is up to you. See you next time!